Hello folks, it's me, I'm Big and I'm back, and this is Let's Play Marvel Avengers Alliance. Um, nothing really new here, um, except for the future future force, future foundation stuff, but um, I mean, I'm not, I don't, I'm not a big fan of the Fantastic Four anyways. Um, so, uh, Chapter 9 is coming up soon, that'll be exciting. Um, also, uh, Rogue, well, nothing new, it's uh, about the end of Spec Ops, um, kind of we Oh, well, let's pick up some time and, uh, uh, might as well start on a new mission. So let's just start playing Desecration. We just got rid of Loki for a minute. And now there's Jotun Court Norning off St. Patrick's Cathedral. Whatever, Frost Giant wants to wear the place of worship. S.H.I.E.L.D. doesn't want him to have it. Excuse me, folks. Let me turn down the mic a bit. Yeah. Let him to have it. Run their fun, agent. That's what we do. Ruin their fun. St. Patrick's a crit 3 though. We are severely over level. This is level 33. So, like, lots of Jotuns. And, um, I'm just going to have my team of over leveled, overpowered superhero Hawkeye and Black Widow and level up and doing stuff. And I'll be right back as soon as I get some events. See you guys in a bit. Why hasn't Namor sent us a formal message? Or come himself? Who knows? The Pulse could have done a number of Atlantis just like it did here. Or he could just not care what's going on. He is Namor, after all. Well, I don't know. Got one during the deploy mission, so I thought I'd show you. Anyways, continuing on our easy peasy, lemon squeezy one mission. Be right back. That sounded like a dead end to me. Wasted time. It's not wasted if we learn something, and we learn that Nemor has hasn't tried to communicate. Don't know about you, but that I find interesting. Well, giving some deploy rewards. Ah, oh, useless. Tentacle strikes not too useless. Agent, since sent the executioner back to Asgard, but he didn't stay there. He's rallying the Jotun around the cathedral, and Doctor Strange is reporting. Well, I'll let him tell it. I sense arcane emanations from within the cathedral. I'm not especially God-fearing, but pagan magic, as St. Patrick's doesn't square with the S.H.I.E.L.D.'s mission. Get in there. Well, we can get into the cathedral if we want to, but uh, we'll wait until the, the, the final team up uh, with um, uh, whoever the boss is. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So the executioner was standing up by the, for the Enchantress. Makes sense. Yep, who, who's the one as guardian can get the executioner to do anything? You mean other than Loki? Loki can sucker him to do things, all so Enchantress has to do is ask. True love, a deranged obsession. Hard to tell them apart, and I have three these new messages. Thank you, whoever sent them. No discernible patterns, but guess what? Our per pet fortune teller says she's recognized the graffiti from her circle of eight visions. Do we believe her? I don't know. Do we? Before we could take the circle of eight seriously, we need a lot more to go on the spray paint and palm reader. At least I do. Okay. Let's just grab and stuff. Ooh. Lots of new stuff I haven't seen before. Um, after two battles, I don't think he's gonna... Yeah. Bored. And the Enchantress. Ooh, lots of enemies. We're teaming up with um, Doctor Strange. Your interrupter reached you far beyond your power to complete. Yeah. Very little is beyond my power, Enchantress, as you are about to discover. By deathless Vishanti, I expel you from this place. I think Doctor Strange has bonus with Iron Man. No doubt. Because he, uh, you get the Illuminati and Egghead, I think. Let, let me just double check that. Um, go to the forum. Go to the tutorials and guides. Heroes team up bonuses. Uh, Doctor Strange. Uh, Hulk. Iron Man. Or Scarlet Witch. Either one is fine. Well, too bad he doesn't have anyone. Um, well, I think for the sake of... Let me see. Wave 2. We've got... Uh, <laughs> It's not going to matter, is it? Let's just change up and have uh, Scarlet Witch be here. Because 
it's interesting to see how Scarlet Witch works. She's only level 4 at the moment, but, um, yeah. Let's continue. Let's do the fight. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got hurt. I'll just show you how broken I am at the moment. Yep, that's how broken. And let me just kill one of you. Dead. And you could just do the devil horn. <laughs> Still don't have my voice back properly. Yeah. Axled. Bishop, defensive, the stamina replaced the bishop. And let's see. I think we could get rid of the enchantress with the ooh, mod. Ancient Rosen mod. Ooh. Okay, let's just get rid of um you. And devil horns. Nice. No challenge at all. Uh, so, let's see. Yeah, I want more some of these. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The key three of her spirit of enchanters and her dark magics. She didn't complete it? She achieved something, I know that what, but a ritual she spoke of collapsed with an agent and I entered. I'll call that a win. See if you can figure out what she was up to. So, here we are, we're done for now, and exiting the map to grab some silvers, and I think, oh no, we need eight, six runic sigils, nah, I shouldn't have left. Anyways, I guess that we'll have to wait till next time, <laughs> and let's see, who should I pick for a player of the day? got some requests, but I'm not sure if your levels are high enough. Um, uh, Alexandro, Brian Marber, Keep, David, Hog, Rob, Zangio. Look at all these new players. I've never even seen some of these players before. I've seen Daniel and Peter before and Sadan before. Poppy. Andrew, you're leveling up pretty well. That's nice. Um, Joseph has, hasn't been leveling up for a while. Um, this is Ethan Valerio. Oh, sure is this. I think you were the one who requested, so yeah, let's 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 see your profile. Let's see your profile. A wait 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 wait. Could, 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 yeah, I'll just um I'll just do you as as one of the players of the day, I guess. Well you have the rook, we have the mind killer, Starks, Isotope, Kayakin, and the bolt action for boar. Well uh -huh. I think uh Kicks like a mule is not a very strong. Um, it's it's an okay weapon. I don't think it's a very strong weapon. You're you're all about attack, 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 attack. So it's it's a poor choice, really. And uh, I mean, let me just check. Okay, you do have Emma Frost and you do have Phoenix. So that's that's um, you have that going for you. But um, the thing about it is, you've got. Attack options, but no defensive options, no other options. Stark Industries as a top cannon is an interesting choice because it hits lots of enemies, so they drop more items. But I mean, uh, we're not farming, we're not at the age of farming for command points anymore. And um, applying ISO 8 corruptions is nice and all, um, but as you can see, it's not a lot of damage in comparison to maybe the Rook. And the Rook by itself is meh. I'd rather stick to Mind Killer. Mind Killer is a ranged energy gun which which um, takes that extra damage against psychic attacks. And I don't know if there's any other thing available for for um, a psychic attack based kind of team. And I mean, uh, the only thing I could think of is if you use your own character as a tank with with um, with either uh, Phoenix or Emma Frost as your sides, but. I mean that's that's um 
that's an in, that's an interesting strategy on on, on itself. Uh, I mean, I would rather you know have uh, a more diverse kind of um, weapon system rather than just you know attack options like bolt action B4 bore. You know, you've got lots of you've got lots of um, other other things that you could you could equip. Um, like, uh, let me just see here. Uh, I'm not higher level enough, so some of these things aren't unlocked yet. But I mean, um, I think so, some of these on these these pages, quantum jumpers is always a choice. But I mean, uh, I don't think it's it's very uh, if you're not going to spend gold on it, it's not worth it. I think morale boost is okay. But my choice would probably be um, construction matrix or um, infinite injections. Interesting as well, but. Um, uh, let me see some of these locked. Um, Paladin Array is interesting because protects allies from single attacks and reduces. But I think Sudden Support is pretty interesting too um, to give yourself a bit of damage boost. But I would probably look for something that, that grants myself some sort of force field for my for myself. Well, Aegis Defender doesn't doesn't really work very well. But um, I mean. Or maybe digital decoy is pretty interesting as well. Um, well, it's up to you if if you're going to yeah um, use something for yourself or use something that's kind of like um, early warning, agile. You know, I don't know. Yeah. Or if 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 you're into kind of like defensive weapons, then you could look at some of the the ones that I have. Um, I mean. I think some of these counterattack. I'm not sure which ones. Um, there's nothing is Viper Showtail counterattacks. Um, not the Tyrant Blade, no. Yeah, but but looking at my stuff, um, not not my store. Looking at my stuff, I've got more uh, kind of like either I've got like the Knight. Enchanted crowbar, you know, but these these are limited edition items as well. The knight enchanted crowbar, uh, even the Gretchen side, the Grant's counter attack would be would be nice. But I mean, that's that's up to you. That's up to um, like what you're gonna use as as a as a defensive mechanism. Even things like the free spider sense injector would be interest would be better on yourself because um, it's it's a free turn and grants extra turns. Yeah. But yeah, up to you, man. I mean, all, all the power to you, more power to you. Things like this as well, you know, save it to his claw that counters attack with bleed. It's interesting, yeah. But yeah, I'd rather you have some sort of counter attack mechanism if you if you are playing with Emma Frost and you're playing with um, Phoenix. But otherwise, you know, more power to you. I, I'd rather have some more support stuff on your other slots. But anyways, that's it for play of the day. Um, Agent Cherestes, I've got, um, I'll post his, um, uh, I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll see you guys a little bit later. It's been another episode of Let's Play Marvel Avengers Alliance. It's me and Biggie, and I'll be back. See you guys in a bit.